Alright, hello YouTube viewers, this is Alec, and this is another World of Warcraft video. Um, as you can see right now, I have not started playing yet. I'm still on the character, uh, select screen. Right here, this is my, uh, level 17 Warlock. I can click my minion. And, this is my level 22 Pally. Um, as you can see, I am in the Forgotten Coast, and it's a PvP realm. And this is the realm in which my guild is in. The guild is Serpent's Betrayal. I'll put a... I'll type out the name of it in the description on here. But right now, I'm not going to play as one of these two. Right now, I'm going to create a new character. And I'm actually going to uh, play something completely different. I'm going to start a Let's Play now of a race that a lot of people consider OP, but... I find them to be one of the easiest to make a let's play of. That's the Death Knight. Um, I've been wanting to do a let's play of all for a while. And I'm going to be a Death Knight Orc. So while I'm change, uh, messing with my Orc a little, I'll tell you more. But I've been wanting to do a let's play of all for a while. But I just never knew how to start. Um, I just never liked... Um, just none of the character, none of the races seem to have a good enough background story. And then I created one Death Knight, and I just fell in love with their story. So I was like, well, if I'm going to play, do a let's play, it I should do one de of a character race in which I like. And the Death Knight was that race. Um, so I'm going to start it now. Um, I'm not going to get far in it. In this video, I'm just going to do some basic starting quests, like quite possibly go up to after I get the my first steed, and then that will be it uh, for this video at least. Um, I won't. I'm going to do this all the way up to 85, and maybe possibly sometime after 85. But that's where my direction for WoW is going right now. Um. On the guild, um, there's some issues going on with me trying to record. Mainly the fact that I can't... Whenever I'm recording these videos, I'm recording and talking on Skype at the same time. And World of Warcraft, Frap, Skype, even with this laptop, I can't run all those at the same time without having a few issues. So... That's the main reason why the guild videos aren't being put up. But we have created the guild. We have done some dungeon runs. We have currently done five. Uh, four different dungeons. So one dungeon we repeated. I can't remember which one. But as soon as we find a way to be able to record. Um, I will be playing as the Tarn Paladin. And we'll be putting up dungeon videos. And if anyone else gets fraps and they want to record like some of them and put some of what they do and put it on there, that'll be open. So it's going to be like an open video, an open channel for everybody. And we are currently trying to get a YouTube channel for the guild. Alright, so I have my Death Knight ready. I kind of like this hairstyle. I've just been partial towards the pulled back style and the uh, two braids for an orc so all right my name miliardo um i believe that's how it's spelled i think there's no there's one l um if it's misspelled then oh well i'll just say someone else in the realm had it <laughs> done it before but if you don't know what this is from this is from mobile suit gundam wing which if you've seen if you knew saw the other characters on my character selection screen. Um, I had Troa. And I had Peacecraft. Peacecraft name is Miliardo's last name. Honestly every other Gundam character I could think of. Think of. Their name was taken. So we're going to try Miliardo. And it's unavailable. Let's try it with two L's. And Miliardo with two L's works. So. Alright. We're going to start this let's play. Uh, turn the volume up. Yeah, uh, my laptop feels like cooperating. All 
Alright, let's begin this let's play. A hero. That's what you once were. You stood boldly against the shadow and purchased another dawn for the world with your life. But the evil you fought is not so easily banished. The victory you claimed, not so easily held. For now, the specter of death looms above the world yet again, and it has found new champions to bring about its final reign. Knights of darkness, wielding runes of death and destruction, bound by the will of the Lich King. This is the hour of their ascension. This is the hour of your dark rebirth. All right, um, I'm not going to need this right now, but I will later. That was my recount setting. Let's uh, see. If, oh, yeah, play specialization. Uh, no one is online. All right. Sorry about that. I just really needed to check to make sure that no one was going to interrupt this. So, look around. All right. What's this called? Oh, okay, the Ebb and Hold. That's the name I can't remember. Alright. Go up and talk to the Lich King. All life must end. Alright, and I don't know if you can see this or not, so I'm going to go ahead and read it. All that I am, anger, cruelty, vengeance, I bestow upon you, my chosen knight. I have granted you immortality so that you may herald an, in a new, bleh, a new dark age for the Scourge. Gaze now upon the lands below us. The Scarlet Crusade scurries to undo my work where Light's hope stands defiantly against us. A blemish upon these plague lands. They must all be shown the price of their defiance. You will become my, fir my force of retribution. Where you tread doom will follow. Go now and claim your destiny, Death Knight. Alright. And now we just go to talk to my instructor. Alright, I completely forgot that he pretty much just tells you what that quest line says, so... Anyways... <laughs> now you heard what the Lich King sounds like. And yes, I do know we're in Cataclysm, so the Lich King is dead. But the Death Knights start in a... Kind of like a time loop. It's a alternate dimension, pretty much. Alright, so now I am going to talk to my uh, instructor. Just walking, just walking. Uh, you have heard the call of the Lich King, Death Knight. Now is the time to answer your master. Alright. The single most important piece of equipment to a Death Knight is the is the Rune Blade. It is through the Rune Blade that the, a Death Knight can, commands the power of Frost Blood and Unholy. The Rune Blade also acts as a vessel to restore Death Knight's runic power. The time has come to create your first dream blade. Search the weapons rack on the floor. Locate a bow worn sword. Once found, take it to the sword. Take the sword to a nearby rune forge and use it to create a rune blade. Alright. Um, while I'm doing this, I want to know. Uh, pretty much you'll see what I'm doing. Just. Oh yeah, I need to edit some stuff. Alright, excuse me while I'll do this, but. Oops. Um. Anyone who plays this game, 
tell me if you have a death knight or something and tell me some of the things that you did because though I do have a death knight I haven't gotten that far in him um, so if you were a blood death knight or something tell me what you um did that I'm doing differently that what you chose that I'm not choosing um see did they okay save this time um what runes are best to have right here at the beginning alright and I have to go down to find Let's see Oh yeah, I have to click it. Alright. And I now have my sword. Now I'll go back to talk to this guy. Oh, that just looked cool. Alright. Alright, roll well done, Miliardo. You have, you have successfully created your first rune-bladed weapon. With it, you will sow the seeds. And decline that. Alright, sorry. With it, you will sow the seeds of chaos and destruction, and your wake will be a bloodied field of battle. Littered, littered with the corpse of all, the wood, all that would dare oppose the scourge. Bleh. Okay. The mark of death is etched. F All right, the mark of death is etched indelibly upon your soul, Death Knight. You have learned the ad you have learned the dark art of rune forging, and with it, you will engrave runes of power upon your weaponry. And don't walk away. Preparation for battle must be made. Return to one of the rune forges here in the heart of Ah. Okay. Heart of Echorus and use the power of rune forging to ablaze in your weapon with a rune power. Return to me when your bl when your blade glows with dark energy. Right? But yeah, like I'm saying, um when you get to when I get to the talent tree, tell me what talents you put in. Um yeah, no, pretty much just Alright. I jumped everywhere with that, but I like to read out those questings. Especially for the Death Knight because theirs is just amazing. Um, reopen up this and do that. But yeah, so apologize ag I apologize again for getting so sidetracked, but um, just explain to me all the stuff that you did to make yours your death knight the way it is so all right remember these words death knight the rune forge is a scourge instrument it exists only in the acris naxxramas and the heart of ice Cr heart of ice crown you may only ablaze your weapon weaponry at a rune forge return often and em emblazon all of your weapons and a death knight must be prepared for all that would dare oppose him yeah, and you get a lot of experience for just completing one. That was one quest right there, and I was like, I was barely like right there in the experience, and now I've jumped way up there, so. Alright, the endless hunger, bleh, the endless hunger will soon take hold of you, Death Knight. When it does, you will feel pain immeasurable. There is only one remedy for the suffering. The hunger must be sated. I give you the key to your salvation. Ke Chained to the heart of Acherus are those deemed unworthy of the Dark Brotherhood. Use the key to free an unworthy initiate and follow them. And allow them to equip their gear and battle you for, for their freedom. Kill and kill and the pain will cease. Fail and suffer for eternity. Live or die. The choice is yours to make. Alright. And pretty much all I do in this quest, I just go down to one of these guys. Uh, choose to fight them and then kill them. Um. So no. It's like you. Okay, you torn. I'm gonna take you out. It's too far away. All 
Alright, I'm going to let him get his armor. Why did I choose the torrent? Because I don't like torrents. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. And if for anyone wondering, I am not going to be a Blood Death Knight. I'm actually going to be Unholy and Frost in that order. So, Unholy, Main, Frost, um, uh, Alt Spec. Alright. As expected, my chosen Death Knight has triumphed. You are ready, Miliardo. Behold, Acris, the Grand Citadel of Death. It has no equal in this world. Not even the mighty Naxxramas could withstand a direct assault from the Ebon Hold. Looming above the face of Necropolis is the all-seeing eye of Acherus. From it the Master is able to see great distances into ter territories held by our enemies. With the what the eye sees, the Lich King sees. And now the time has come for you to pe for you to pierce through the eye. The Lich King has called for you, Miliada. Go now. Suffer well, brother. <laughs> 